The city never sleeps. And when it's not sleeping, it's stirring up trouble. And when it finally passes out from exhaustion, it dreams about stirring up more trouble. My name's Kovac. I worked for the government until we had a rough breakup. Now I'm a private eye. So, if you're out in my city making trouble, I'm the one who's gonna Gloria? break Gloria? Oh! Are you coming? Sorry, Bo. I was just practicing my undercover voice. Your first client is on the phone. Oh, I got it. And maybe you should be a little less hard-boiled. That's my Bo. His name's Bo. A straight shooter with legs that just won't quit. Especially when we're sprinting away from a jilted husband. Kovac Detective Agency, if you're looking for something, we'll find it. Oh, uh, yes, Miss Kovac, uh... My name is Franklin Warburton. I, I spoke to your secretary on the phone yesterday. Ah, uh, yes. Bowden copied down everything you said, Mr. Warburton. Bowden's the fastest number two on the east side. I see. I understand you're a restaurateur. Oh, nothing so lofty, to be sure. I'm merely a philanthropist and an angel investor. Interesting. My Google search couldn't turn up anything you'd philanthropized. Well, I don't like to take credit, Miss Kovac. Uh, the joy is in the act of the support, as you understand. I'm afraid my latest investment is... Uh... This would be Antoine Boucher, the French patisserie chef? Yes, I, I, I simply loved him in the stint on the, the great French bake-off. But after the show, he had great difficulty launching a professional career. Always a Sue and never a chef, you mean. Well, he came to me with a rather unique pitch for a restaurant. The Long Pancake. The Long Pancake? Isn't that joint supposed to open up next week downtown? It is, God willing. You see, Antoine developed a self-flipping griddle that runs the entire length of the restaurant. He cooks up a 300-foot pancake in front of the customers. They choose a section, they sprinkle their favorite toppings. I tell you, it's ingenious. But the critics attended last night and gave us a sneak peek at the reviews, and, well, let's just say... Uh, they didn't flip their flapjacks over the long pancake, huh? Antoine was so distraught. I fear he's liable to do something drastic before we open tomorrow morning. How drastic? Well, uh, we jointly own the business, so uh, he owns half of the building. And half of the fire insurance. Is that what you're getting at? Uh, I tell you, I, I can't approach the police without... It. Evidence or some, some some proof, some some witness to what he's doing. I, I need an investigator. Can you help me, Miss Kovac? Chin up, Mr. Warburton. I'll stake out your establishment all night. And if Antoine Boucher tries to put the flambe on a long pancake, he'll be toast. Oh, bless you, Miss Kovac. Gesundheit, Mr. Warburton. I'll be in touch. Hey, Bo? Yes, boss? Let's take a short drive to a long pancake. We jumped in my sunflower yellow sedan. A little number I called Daisy. Daisy got us to the long pancake in 20 minutes, and I didn't even floor it through any yellow lights. There's the pancake. No lights on. Doesn't look like Boucher is here yet. Are you wired up? Like a Christmas tree. Just get that chef to spill his cookies, and this case is closed. Shh! What was that? I didn't hear anything. I hear someone in the alley. Hold tight. Be careful. I cocked the trigger on my trusty old twenty-two and slipped into the dark alley. I knew one wrong step could spell the end of my dance lessons. Who's there? Trouble. <gasps> the good cut. Oh, Chet Phillips. We used to work together, back when we lived off of old Uncle Sam's dime. Chet, what are you doing here? I'm everywhere, Kovac, especially when you need help. I thought you were doing dirty work for Terry Millionaire, philanthropist billionaire. You yeah, shouldn't believe everything you read in the papers. The day I read about you in the papers, Phillips, you'll probably be in the obituaries. It'll be long and interesting, just like me. Okay, knock it off, Phillips. What's Terry Millionaire got to do with this? Is Warburton one of his buddies? Who's Warburton? I'm here looking for drugs. Try Walgreens. I've scoped out this long pancake, and looky here. Five pounds of fentanyl. He's importing it from Guatemala. Oh, give me that bag. But, but don't taste it. Are you crazy? That isn't fentanyl, Chet. It's pancake flour. It can't be. Three police officers passed out just looking at this bag. Will you get out of here before... Hey, boss. The chef has entered the kitchen. Damn it, Chet. You made me miss my mark. I'm coming with you. Not a chance. You just tell me one thing. Who tipped you off about this fake fentanyl? A guy named Lester Macaron. Said he was one of Boucher's investors. Gloria? Phillips, I could kiss you if I wouldn't immediately throw up afterwards. Please don't. Let's go, Bo. <laughs> For 
berries, Antoine. Oh. And I don't mean your gelato. Mon Dieu. Gloria Kovac, your reputation as a private investigator precedes you. Wow, and this is only our first case. What do you think you're doing with that gas canister, Antoine? Oh, you have caught me, no? I will set fire to this long griddle, my greatest failure. And I will burn with it, as so burns my great shame. He's gone full Ray Fines. Spoilers. Oh, flee now, lest you... Witness my immolation and self-basting. But isn't that what you want? Quoi? Evidence in the form of two ace private eye witnesses? Uh, qu'est-ce que c'est? That's why you hired us, Antoine Boucher, a.k.a. Lester Macaron, a.k.a. Franklin Warburton. What? He hired us to investigate himself? Très bien, Miss Kovac. Oh. Oh. Drop your revolver. Oh, jeez. Slow on the draw. I suppose it was my ridiculous American accent that they gave it away. No. It was you and your two partners who each owned half your business. Partners for whom Google turns up no backgrounds whatsoever. So you're saying he invented his backers? Probably to bilk the bank out of a loan before lighting this place on fire and faking his own death so he can make his real money illegally farming wheat in deforested Guatemalan Amazon land for pennies on the dollar. There's blood on those pancakes, Boucher. There's at least sap on those pancakes. I will turn that sap to syrup once I've re-established a new identity as a South American businessman, Antoine Boucher dies tonight, along with you. Ha! Ah! Gloria, he's lit the long griddle! Starting at the far end of the restaurant, each little pilot light will light the next one, and the next one. And once the fire crosses the griddle and reaches the boiler's pilot light here, Boom! <laughs> It'll take you with it, too. I will be long gone. Here, take this kitchen twine. Tie yourself up in the girl. Never! I could shoot you both now. <laughs> then they'll find our bodies with the bullets baked right into them. Your uh, cooking analogies are going quite this way. Now tie her up. No, let me do it, Bo. This is not how I wanted to go out. Hog tied to a woman while lit on fire in a pancake house. Actually, now that I think about it... Hurry up! Pull your cream puffs, Antoine! I'm just remembering my knots! You are not tying that to his legs. What are you tying that to? Oh, just this ten-pound bag of pancake flour! Hi-ya! Nice! I'm not feeling that crap! Gotcha! Yeah! Roll this one in sugar and call him French toast, Bo! Ha! Gloria! The pilot lights! Holy crap! Get down! Ah! Mm-hmm. <laughs> what the... You two are lucky I found the gas line. Oh, oh Phillips. Always showing up at the last minute to take the collar. Oh, you take this one, Kovac. You did the legwork. You're one sharp cookie. You know that? What kind of cookies do you eat that they're sharp? You're a tough nut to crack, too. Good working with you. Oh, my God. We're not working together, Chet. Bye, I... partner. <sighs> Come on, Gloria. Let's take this flower smuggler to the police, and then I'll take you to IHOP. Make it waffles instead, and you got yourself a deal, good looking. Well, that's the way the eggs break in this frying pan we call the big city. Sometimes all you can do is mix in some peppers and onions and make a western omelet. But things hashed out this time, and that's no small potatoes. My name's Kovac, and I'm a private eye. You've been listening to Gloria Kovac, P.I., The Long Pancake. Starring Paige Klinecki as Gloria Kovac, Dave Stanger as Bowden Moncrief, Kirk White as Chet Phillips, and Bob Killian as Antoine Boucher. Written and edited by Pete Barry. This has been a Porch Room production. Another quality podcast from the Porch Room. <laughs>